This video gives a brief demonstration of accessing MyUHI, which is a virtual computer service available to all students and staff at the University of the Highlands and Islands. You can access MyUHI from the UHI website, which is located at www.uhi.ac.uk. Click on the students link towards the top right of the page and then on the My UHI button on the next page. A new page opens up and you can see from the URL that you could also go directly there by typing my.uhi.ac.uk. When you first log on, you may be asked to install the Citrix plugin which is necessary to run My UHI. You should place a tick to accept the Citrix license agreement and then click the green install button. A dialog box opens and it is quicker if you can run the file. You can also save it to your disk and run it from there. The download process starts and you will be asked to confirm if you wish to run the file. While the plugin is installing, You'll see a message asking you to keep a lookout for a yellow information bar which may appear towards the top of the browser page. A dialog box will tell you when the installation is complete. And when the screen refreshes, you'll be told that the client is installed. You can then log on using your UHI ID and password. While we are at this screen, it may be as well to have a look at the messages. I did say earlier that it was possible to run the plugin installation file directly from the internet but that it is sometimes best to save the file onto your local disk and run it from there. And this is what is referred to in the top warning message. There is a separate video available which will take you through the steps required. The second information message suggests that we add my UHI to the trusted sites and I am taken to a page with instructions for doing this. First, I'll copy the link at the top of the page by selecting it and using Control C, or you could right click and select Copy Shortcut from the menu. Then I need to click on the Tools menu and select Internet Options. Click on the Security tab and then on the Trusted Sites button. Paste the link into the box provided using Control V and then click the Add button. You'll notice the last point in the instructions advise that it may be as well to log off having made these changes and then log back on again. Now I am taken to the My UHI icon and when I click it, a number of processes are started which take me into My UHI. If you get this security message, tick the box at the bottom so that you are not asked this question repeatedly and click Permit Use. When you are logged onto My UHI, you will see that quite a range of standard programs are installed for your use. If I run one, you will also see that it opens quickly.
To log off, just go to the Start button and select Log Off. Don't worry about any messages that tell you something needs to close. These will close automatically. When you come back to the browser page, log off at this point also.